Today is day 26 of the J.J. Smith 30-Day Green Smoothies for Life Challenge. And today's smoothie is a strawberry banana smoothie. It has one cup of pineapple, one cup of strawberries, one banana, and everything is frozen. Remember, always try to make sure that your fruit is frozen. If you're one of those people that like to buy fresh fruit, cut it up, pop it in the freezer. Always make a smoothie with frozen items. And we need one and a half cups of water, which I have not put in here. So, as you know, I have my Brita. And if you have not gotten your Brita, you need to get you a Brita. Stop spending all that money on bottled water. One and a half cups of water. And I hope everyone is doing well in light of what's going on in the world because I know it's hard for everybody, present company included, it is hard. But I'm that person that likes to stay home anyway. I'm that person that's always sheltering in place. I don't have to be out in the streets because what happens when you leave home? When you go out in the streets, what you do? You're spending money. Now you're staying at home and you're saving money. Now, you might be on Amazon still spending money or going to these different little websites. Don't get caught up in that. As long as you got some food, paper towels, toilet paper, your PG&E is on, your water is on, you good. Stay in the house and stay safe. Three cups of spinach. Strawberries, pineapple, and one frozen banana. I always put my bananas in the freezer. And we have our flax. What I put in here today is flaxseed, chia seed, and I have some um, vanilla protein powder. And I'm using protein powder by J-Rob. And it's not plant-based. It's a whey protein powder. And it has a really, really good flavor. It's kind of pricey, but it's worth the money. Done. Remember, if you don't have to go to the store, stay out of those stores, please. Limit yourself to those visits to the grocery store. And they recommend that you send one family member. Everyone does not need to go. That's her recommendation, I believe, is either the Surgeon General or the CDC, or it could have been Dr. Fauci, or it could have been all three. And limit your exposure to people. Okay. This looks good. Strawberry, banana, pineapple. Take this straw. This is one of them, I want to start partying, I want to start dancing. When I drink this smoothie, this is a good, this is a dancing smoothie, okay? We're just going to dance, dance, and drink this smoothie. Very good. Also, remember, make sure you are drinking your apple cider vinegar water. I made some today, and all I did was water, apple cider vinegar, that's it. I didn't put anything else in it because I just wanted just raw vinegar and water, nothing extra. But I did also make another one. I made this one last night. And this is the one that has everything in it. I'm talking about the, um, I didn't put chia seeds in it. I used the Leon flax seeds in this one. Now, if you have not tried Leon flax seeds, they sell this at Walmart. It's $9.99, so $10.00. And they also sell this on Amazon, and it's like $12 or $13 on Amazon for the same exact product. So know your prices when you're buying things, but this is really good. And they suggest that you, I put this in my smoothies too. 
but they suggest that you, before bedtime, put this in beverage of your choice, whether it's water, whether it's juice, whether it's a smoothie, apple cider vinegar, whatever, before you go to bed, two tablespoons of this, and this is this will help your digestive tract. Okay, this is the Leon flaxseed, and this is really, really good. If you don't know about this product, Google it. It's a very good product. And like I said, and with this one, I have the Leon flaxseed in here, and I also have my zeal, which I like to put, use the zeal. The zeal is really good. It has a really good flavor, and it's also a meal replacement. So if you're not using zeal, get you some zeal. And this also has the apple cider vinegar in it. So make sure you're doing that. Don't forget your detox teas. My detox teas right here. And I also have, um, what do you call it? Cinnamon sticks in the bottom of this. This is ginger detox tea. And it has cinnamon sticks and it has lemon in it. So this is another good one. But make sure you're keeping your body detox. Make sure your body is staying very acidic -y. They say the coronavirus does not like the acid environment. And that's what they say. I don't know if this is true or not because I've been doing apple cider vinegar for a long time. I've been keeping my body very, very acidic. I will not let a day go by that I don't drink my apple cider vinegar. And also, I drink at least two of these a day. The apple cider vinegar water. Minimum two a day. Okay, so... My system stays acidic. And make sure you're doing something fun at home. Don't just be, you know, just because we're in this pandemic right now, don't just be sitting around thinking doom and gloom. I had someone call my girlfriend the other day and tell my girlfriend, oh, it's over, it's over. You know, what do you do that at? Don't call me with the doom and gloom. I don't want to hear it. It's over when it's over. It's going to be what it's going to be. Everybody stay healthy. Everybody, when you're out shopping, make sure you are protecting yourself. Make sure that you have your face mask. I make these. This is the top. It has a wire in the top of this and it opens up and it fits, you know, straight into your face. It also, I put another area of protection up in here and something else you can use. You can take a coffee filter. If you have a face mask that has a pocket in it, this is a pocket right here. So you can stick something up in here. And all you do, you just take a coffee filter, something for your coffee. You fold it in half. Always use the whole thing. And you insert this filter into your mask. Insert it into your mask. Now, this is another layer of protection. This is not an N95, but you have to protect yourself by any means necessary. So make sure you have a face mask. And make sure that it fits snugly. Put it on. There you go, face mask. Don't walk around without your face being protected. Make sure you have your gloves. Make sure you have... Now, this is just me. This is Clorox and water. This is an empty container. I had used it up and I was going to throw it away. And I threw it away and I said, wait a minute. I can use this for something. So I pulled it back out. I filled it up with water. And I put two to three tablespoons of bleach or cap full, capfuls of bleach in here and it's real in this and I'm telling you this is really really bleachy and this is cheaper than buying the Clorox cleanup this is your one of your best lines of defense when you go grocery shopping those carts even if they have even if they say oh we have people that clean the carts uh uh take this spray your cart down paper towels or disinfectant wipes whatever wipe your cart down yourself you have your gloves on, spray a little bit on your gloves. Do this. Now, whatever you're touching in that store, 
if the person before you or the person before them came through and they had the coronavirus and they coughed on something and say, you know, unbeknownst to you, and you touch it, well, guess what? You got that bleach on your gloves. Not on your hands, but the bleach is on your gloves. And whatever touches your gloves is going to die. It is going to kill it. Now, when you get to your produce section, you might want to get you some paper towels out. Because remember, you got bleach on your gloves. Get you some paper towels out. Pick your produce. Pick your produce. Keep on going. You might want to hit it just a little bit more. Do it again. Everything you touch in that store, your hands are protected with the bleach water. So be smart about this. A lot of this stuff is common sense. And all, all sense ain't common. Everybody don't have common sense. But use your common sense and protect yourself by any means necessary. Your face mask. Always have a face mask. And this particular face mask is made out of um, jean fabric. It's a real thin jean fabric. And I made this. Oh, by the way, I make and sell these. Okay. These face masks sell for $15 a piece. These are washable. You wear them over and over. You make sure you get you some filters. Filters are very inexpensive. You pay about $5 and you get about $700, $500 to $700 for a filter. Okay. You cannot beat it. So what's that about? A penny, a filter. Protect yourself at all costs. Make sure you have your gloves. Make sure you have your bleach water. If you don't have Lysol spray and things like that, bleach water, I paid 98 cents for a gallon of bleach. Okay. I have a whole, whole a lot of protection, but I also have the Clorox cleanup. I have Lysol spray and I know all this stuff is hard to come by, but I've been buying stuff for months and months. And that's just me. I go to the store. I see it's on sale. Oh, I, I'm going to need this one day. So let me just get it. So when all this hit, I was prepared. I have what I need to survive for a, for a minute, for a long time groceries, I have that, you know, when people was doing the run on the toilet paper, I already had toilet paper and things, but don't, don't buy up all the toilet paper because leave some for somebody else because the toilet paper, they're going to make more. They're going to make more. You can't just wipe the virus away. Okay. So with that being said, I want everybody to make sure you're taking care of yourself. Make sure you're staying healthy. Make sure you're exercising. Make sure you're, um, you're walking, get out every day, get out and go walking. Make sure you have your mask on when you go walking. If you're just around the house, and you don't have anything to do, put on, turn on some music, put on YouTube, get the music popping. You get to lock it and you just start doing your thing. Just start having fun. Take it on back. And another thing, do a date night. Don't just be sitting around the house. Y'all looking at each other. Y'all all bored with each other and stuff. Do some fun stuff like I used to do when y'all used to date. Make it fun. It don't have to be just like, oh, God, we stuck in here together. No, it don't have to be like that. Make your time together fun. Start getting back to knowing each other. Start enjoying each other again. Men, women, or whoever, whatever your relationship is with your significant other, make sure you guys are having a good time. Make sure you guys are staying healthy. Make sure you are drinking your green smoothies. Make sure you are drinking your detox water. Like I said, this is just straight water and apple cider vinegar only. That's all this is in here. My system is so used to the taste. I don't have to have anything sweet. I do my zeal in here so I can hit it all at one time, but I can just drink this stuff raw and uncut. And it has to be the apple cider vinegar that says it has the mother in it. That's the apple cider vinegar you want. And... Again, your Brita. If you haven't gotten your Brita, get your Brita. I have orders today for my um, these masks that I make. And I'm getting ready to... Well, this is another mask that I made that I wear out. This is my other one that I wear this one out. But this one, when I made this one, I didn't make it with the filter. This was my first one. After this mask... All my masks have a special addition add-on filter. There is a filter in this mask, but I want it where I can put an extra layer of protection. And all you need to do that is coffee filters for that extra layer of protection. 
If anybody out there wants to get a mask, can't make a mask, or don't have anybody to make you a mask, hit me up. I got you. If you have not subscribed to my channel, don't forget to hit the subscription button, the notification bell, your thumbs up, like, Share this video out with others so that they can see what's going on over here with your girl eating with food for thought Roberts, also known as the personal chef, also known as food for thought, also known as champagne nights and caviar dreams. And that's another channel that I have. And That's all about relationships. Talking about relationship is adult talk. It's not for children. It's for adults only. So if you haven't checked that channel out, go by and check out Champagne Nights and Caviar Dreams. I upload a video at least once a week on that channel. I try to do more on this channel, but because of everything that's going on right now, I'm really busy with making these masks because I got tons and tons of orders that have come in and they just came in, bam, they hit me up yesterday with a ton of orders. And then this morning when I woke up, I had a ton more. So I'm going to be busy making face masks for people who don't, who can't get to face masks because I know, I know it's hard to find face masks. And luckily for me, I do have these also, you know, in a pinch because I have put these on and then my first face mask that I did have the additional filter in, I would wear this one and then I would put that mask over this one. So it keeps me doubly, double protected. Okay. And that's the key here is to be protected. And I will see you on day 27 of the JJ Smith 30 Day Green Smoothies for Life Challenge. And if you have not joined my group on Facebook, it's Eating with Food for Thought Roberts. We're all about different things. We're about paleo, keto. So we're all about just different things. Just come on by and check us out and join our group too. I don't care if you weigh 200 pounds, 300 pounds, 100 pounds. Make sure that you like what you're looking at and make sure that you are happy with you. And with that being said, that's my time. I'm getting ready to start making these face masks. Because people need these. See you on day 27.